What's up everybody? Welcome back to the car for another episode of After the Previews Reacts. Tonight I'm reacting to War of the Planet of the Apes, the third in this new revitalized, rebooted Planet of the Apes franchise. This movie was awesome. Um, I'm, I'm really stoked that I went and saw this movie because uh, I, I literally could have done anything else with my night and this, this was... This was up there in like top five things that I could have done on a Thursday night. So that was cool. Um, really though, I, I I didn't watch any trailers for this movie, so I don't know how much of this is a spoiler. I don't wanna I don't wanna talk too much about stuff that went on during the movie because this is just the reaction. We'll uh, Garrett and I will review uh, this weekend, and then that will be up later on in the week. So anyway. Um, what I want to say that I, I'm hoping is not too much of a spoiler, this little girl who's in this movie has very few lines and I think she might still be one of my favorite parts of the movie. It, it, she was she was great. Just facial expressions alone, especially given that she's acting with a bunch of uh, you know computer generated characters. I don't know how exactly they filmed this, if there was a stand in or if there was someone there doing all the ape characters, but even if there was or wasn't, it, it doesn't really matter because she had no lines or she had very few lines and the, just the way that she reacted with these apes that may or may not have actually been there when they were filming, like this was this was some A grade like not maybe not Oscar level, uh, but this was some upper level acting man like this, this girl was really impressive so I thought that was really cool um aside from that there's a whole lot of stuff going on in this movie and like I I don't know if uh Matt Reeves does classes or if he teaches people but he needs to teach Zack Snyder how to put a shitload of stuff all in one movie and still make it good because there was even more going on in this movie it felt like than there was going on in Batman vs Superman and this movie all like everything flowed together the story made total sense the emotion was 100% there the whole way through like I, I felt myself getting a little welled up in there I was like oh my god dude there's some sad shit going on like and there's some really happy stuff like there's some stuff that makes you kind of want to get some happy tears going so Honestly, like, I'm inclined to give this movie a 10 out of 10. I mean, I'm hard-pressed to find something I didn't like about this movie. There's one thing, there, I mean, even the camera work. I don't even notice camera work. That's not me. Garrett notices the camera work. But there was one scene, and I'm not going to tell you what it was, but there's like, it's just like, oh, the mood is, oh, shit, it's on. And there's this thing that they did with the camera where it just, it zooms in on Caesar's face as he's, like, realizing, oh, shit, it's on. And it you can just feel it in that moment. You're like... Oh shit, it's on. <laughs> so, um, like I said, I don't even notice. I don't even notice things like that when I usually watch movies. That's not my spot. That's usually Garrett's spot. But I noticed it in this one, and that's how good I thought this stuff was. I, this movie, like I said, I'm hard pressed to find something that I didn't like about it, and. I kind of just want to give it a 10 out of 10 on immediate reaction. So that's been after the previous reacts. I'm going to keep this one short. I'm telling you definitely go see this one, like this video, and subscribe to our channel on YouTube, and like our page on Facebook, and shut off your cell phone.